It's us. Hello. My lips are the same color of your shirt. Nice. So, this is my last week up near Lake George and at my cabin. And there were a few things that I still wanted to do while I was up here. One of them was go to Lake George and go shopping. That's where we are right now. Oh, is that where the car show is? Apparently it is where the car show is. There's apparently a car show going on. So I wanted to go to Lake George and go shopping because I haven't gone this summer. Sorry. Ugh. I went to Sorry. Bolton Landing. What? I, it's hard for me to see. I went to Bolton Landing and got some stuff in Bolton multiple times. <laughs> but I wanted to go to Lake George because they just have like a different vibe of stuff. Like the stuff in Lake George is more touristy. Yeah. And like brighter colors. Like lots of neons and tie-dye and like that kind of a vibe but the stuff in Bolton is more like cabiny cozy Classy. chill like more, more discriminating customer more that kind of a vibe <laughs> so we just went to Lake George we went shopping I dyed the ends of my hair purple I love that that's my favorite um so I'll show you what I got and we are currently on our way to a diner to go eat food. And then we're gonna go to the mall up here. I go to the mall like once a year. I Actually, <laughs> I will have been to two malls this year because I went to a mall with Becca. I know. And now I'm going to a mall here. Do you see that kid being like, do you see that? Yeah. Anyways. So we're going to a diner to get food and then we're going to the mall. And we're supposed to get like horrible, horrible weather tonight. And so this morning, I'm just like sitting in bed watching YouTube. And I get a notification on my phone from like the weather people. <laughs> and they're like, possible tornadoes later today. And I'm like, what the heck? So anyways, I got a name necklace. This is my name in case you didn't know. <laughs> I had a name necklace um, and then it got like tarnished so I gave it to my mom to try to fix it and she hasn't done anything with it and it's been like over a year so I was like I'm just gonna buy another one I couldn't get it I think the silver plating had come off so much that it, it's just not coming good so I want you to find that <clears throat> and then I'm gonna give it to dad and see if dad can fix it up because dad does things like that then, so, okay. I wanted a sweatshirt, but I got two long sleeve shirts instead. And I'm fine with that. Okay, so first shirt. It's hard to do with one hand. We got. Ugh, ta da! So it's like rainbow tie dye. What did we expect from me? And on the pocket, it has Lake George on it. Cute. And then on the back. It has a bigger Lake George on it. Cute. So that's what I got from one store. I lost my name necklace already. Oh, I found it. And then we went into another store. And I got another shirt. <laughs> okay, so this one. Ugh. It's so hard with only one hand. This one also says Lake George. But this one, oh, is black and white and it has stripes on it. Look at how I'm sitting. <laughs> I'm sitting <laughs> like a child. Anyways, Lake George, black and white. My mom was like, really? That doesn't seem like you. And I was like, I know, but that's what caught my eye. So, you were pulling it off. Let me just say a few thoughts from my daily life because I feel like I haven't told you guys my thoughts lately. Okay, so we can have reactions and comments from you on this. Okay. As we all know, my favorite celebrity is Riker Lynch. Yes, he was on a show called Glee. You know who else was on a show called Glee? 
Darren Chris, and I am just dead with this new music. Okay, so he released a five song EP, and two of the songs are like amazing. They're all good, but two of them are like really, really good. So you should go check out Let's. That's the first one. And then the second one is called For a Night Like This. And that one's like my favorite, favorite, favorite song ever. She likes it. She thinks it's really good. That's a great song. If you know song. the song. Oh, what's it called? Celebrate by Cole and the Gang. No. The Trolls song. Oh, okay. Oh, what is that called? I, I don't know. By Justin Timberlake. Can't Stop the Feeling from the Trolls movie. For a Night Like This has the same vibe as that song. See, I think it's got the same vibe as Celebration from Cool the Gang as well. My sequins are reflecting off my face. Have you told them <laughs> about Ted yet? Okay, so... <laughs> I guess that would be no. I have had a kidney stone since... Becca came and visited me. It's that stone. And that has caused a lot of pain in my life. <laughs> um, and it's still not out yet. So we're waiting for it to come out. And first, we hate on it so much that we, we named, named it. it. We named it. We named it Ted. That's Ted. Also, dead so okay <laughs> I'm just like literally dead so also Darren Christian and music related he just announced that he's releasing a Christmas album you can pre order it pre save it whatever it's called now and you can get one of the songs now actually and then the rest come out like in October or whatever but here's like He's so smart. Like, I'm just like dead. Okay, so his name is Darren Chris. And his album is called A Very Darren Christmas. But he spelled Christmas like his last name, Chris, which is C R I S S. So he spelled Christmas C R I S S M A S. And like, I'm like dead. Like, that's so cute. I'm just dead. Do you enjoy my fangirling? <laughs> It's just so cute. I love it. <laughs> I love Darren Chris so much. Like I, I actually, I'm sure I'll love the Christmas album too, and I look forward to listening to that this year. Some good fresh new Christmas music. I played good, her fresh new old Christmas music. The one song that you can like listen to now. We both died. It was so good. It was so good. It was so very good. Michael Bublé-ish, yes. Frank Sinatra-ish in the most excellent way. Okay, comment down below <laughs> if you've seen that commercial for Bubbly, but it has Michael Bublé in it and he's changing it to Bublé. Because <laughs> I think that's hilarious. I like the fact that they got Michael Bublé to be <laughs> in their commercial. And there's been like at least two different ones. Like it wasn't just a one-time thing. He like came back and did another one. Like the funny thing is, is how many people don't get don't know that that's Michael Bublé in the in the bubbly commercial. That's mm -hmm. funny. I bet a lot of people don't know that. I love him. I love his voice. So, anyways, we're off to a diner. So, bye for now. Wait, what? what do you think you're gonna have at the diner? Do you have something in mind? Fish and chips. I got that last time and it was really good. What do you think? I don't know. I was thinking about, first I was thinking about getting a cheeseburger, but I did just have a cheeseburger at Five Guys not long ago, so my cheeseburger craving is not strong. And then I was thinking of getting a turkey club. For some reason that came to mind, so. Are you feeling sandwichy? I think I am. I think I might get fish and chips. So we'll see what we get. I'll vlog what we get. Okay. Fish and chips, pink lemonade, 
What'd you get? A uh, Greek chicken wrap with cucumber sauce, which is like, I love that, and homemade potato salad. Mm. Nice. Hi, it's us! Okay, so we went to a great diner. It was amazing. I got fish and chips. I showed you guys that. So, this morning, I woke up at like 6.30. Cause that's me. Never know when I'm gonna be awake these days. That's just, the truth. Just never know. <laughs> so, I wake up at 6.30. She slept until like 11. But anyways. Um, that was glorious. Now you know why I like to sleep all the time. I would have liked to have kept going, but you were annoying me. Okay. Making me get up because. Because. So I'm just chilling in bed. I thought you were hissing. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. I'm so full. So. I'm sitting in bed and I get a notification on my phone from one of my weather apps and it's like rain today, thunderstorms, impossible tornadoes. So I look at the weather to see when it's going to start raining and stuff and we had decided we were going to leave to go out into town and go shopping and stuff <coughs> at 1 and it was going to start raining and storming and stuff according to my weather app around 2, 2.30. It's now 3.46, not raining yet. But anyways, so I was like, come on, you got to get up. It's going to rain. There's going to be tornadoes. <laughs> and she's like, what are you talking about? And she didn't want to believe me. But I'm like, I'm serious. Well, the weather it's, told it's me. That I didn't want to believe you, but you were making it so dramatic that I could not imagine it was really that. Okay, so. Dangerous that we <laughs> have to get out right now. So then we go to the diner. And as we're paying, there's this other lady waitress person who's just like chilling at the front counter with the guy who's helping us pay and whatever and she was telling us oh did you hear we might get tornadoes later later and i'm like see i told you <laughs> so anyways we might die later <laughs> and i was like i thought my daughter was just being dramatic and no he's like no they said on the news all the the winds and the conditions i told you <laughs> are gonna be good for having a tornado mm-hmm told you so she was vindicated so hopefully we can go shopping at the mall real quick and get home before the toma <laughs> tomatoes tornadoes <laughs> there's this one I think I might have vlogged it there was this one year her and my daughter out shopping at like Lowe's or Home Depot or something and you know, the parents store yeah and I think they were actually buying a generator but <laughs> <laughs> So it's like starting to rain and stuff and I'm like, okay, cool, whatever, it's raining. So then dad texts me. I don't know why you didn't text me, but dad texted me. You know what? I think I was driving. I think that's why. He goes, hey, just so you know, <laughs> there's like a tornado warning for our area, like the cabin. So like, look out. I'm like, thanks. So then like look out. 15 minutes later. He texts me and he's like, hey, can you go up on the deck and bring in my plants? <laughs> I'm like, what? <laughs> so I did. <laughs> I did. Because I'm a good child. But I'm like, we're about to get killed by a tornado. I'm home alone with the pets. And you want me to go upstairs to the deck and go get your plants. Okay. So I did. But anyways. Now we're at the mall. So I'm probably gonna do a mall haul later. Also, look how pale I look. I went to go to the beach slash swimming. Well, I will agree this at year. At least five times or less because for like a month and a half, I was on freaking antibiotics for a kidney infection for the kidney stone that I still have. So frustrating, I'm so pale. Here we go, waiting for this to fall at any moment. <laughs> okay, we're gonna try it. We're just gonna try it. See what happens. Oh, I can tell you what's gonna happen. <laughs> Shh, don't tell it that, okay. Hi, it's me. I spent a lot of money and it was bad. What does that red thing at the top say? Oh, is that it's the- It's my time, it's recording. What? Has that always been like that? Yeah. Hello, welcome to my car haul. So, first, 
we have these heart sunglasses. Rainbowy. Yes. Ta-da, cute. These are from Claire's. So I'll start with Target. Or as I like to call it, Target. So, here we go. We have camo sweatpants. I think these are technically men's. They are. But you know what? Men's sweatpants are better than girls' sweatpants because they're way thicker and way cozier. And that's my story. Well, and we got your dad a pair. Oh, yeah, we got my dad a pair too so we can twin. Okay. So, last year, I told you guys that I have an American Girl doll channel. I bought doll stuff. So, we have. A swim outfit thing ta -da, from our generation we have another swim outfit thing from our generation I'm gonna run out of room we have a pineapple Halloween costume for my cat angel last year she was a taco this year she could be a pineapple very cute. We have pomegranate raspberry EOS. We have dark green swimsuit bottoms. We have a Halloween bow for my Halloween costume. Got some palettes. We have Elf, Earth and Ocean. I got this because this girl I watch on YouTube, Sarah Rose, possibly Sarah Rose Beauty, not sure. She does a lot of like project pans and stuff like that. She's always saying how much she loves this palette, so I was like, okay. And then I have one from Makeup Revolution. Nice, cute. That looks just like the palette we got in our boxy. TV or something like that. Not that one, the other one. Oh, this one? Yeah. Or something we got recently. Well, the colors aren't. These are the colors. Okay. The packaging looks familiar. Anyways, that's my first Target bag. I have two bags from Target. It hasn't fallen over yet! Are you impressed? Oh, I remember. Okay. So we have more dog clothes, pajamas, pizza themed, cute. I need like a car phone mount. And I think these are actually more pajamas. But they're cute. So there you go. No tornadoes yet, by the way. It's not even raining. But it's getting very ominous. It definitely is starting to get ominous. Very ominous. Okay. I got a Burt's Bee Squeezy Lip Balm. Cool. I got a swimsuit top. Cool. I got these like comfy chill bottoms. Cute. I got Burt's Bee's Watermelon makeup wipes. Cute. And then I got a NYX butter gloss and vanilla cream pie. Cute. That was my second Target bag. And this is why I only go to the mall once a year because I buy lots of things and spend lots of money. Plus, I don't like shopping. I know it doesn't seem like that by how much stuff I bought, but I don't like shopping. I'm like the fastest shopper in the world because I don't like shopping. And my mom hates that about me. Because she just wants to leisurely browse at everything. And I'm not about that life. So, we also went to Claire's. That was also bad. Like, really bad. So, I got these glasses. I already showed you. And then, I got two headbands, 
camo and this print which if you guys have watched my channel you would know I'm obsessed <laughs> with anything this print those are very cute I like those I have pajamas this print multiple pairs of pajamas in this print I have bedding in this print I have a lot of things in this print I have blankets in this print I just love this print so much and camo and then they always get me on the earrings they just always do and this is why I only go there once a year. So, we got these earrings. Cute, they're little pom-poms. I love pom-poms. Claire's is like my whole personality in like one store. We got some Halloween earrings. I am ready for spooky season. So ready, cute. Then I got some just like plain, rainbow colored studs because I bought a pack of rainbow studs there last year and I basically wore them all out and the gemstones fell out or the color came off of them so I got some new ones and then I feel like you're driving there you go. Can't, can't help it I got these ones which are like cat themed so cute love cats I got these, which I just thought were like really cool. I got these little lightning bolts, which I also just thought were like really cool. Um, ah! <laughs> I'm holding my phone. That wasn't even that bad. Where's the rain? Where's the tornadoes? I got these little snakes. If you guys didn't know, I'm a Slytherin in Harry Potter. Also, I really want to get a pet snake. One day it will happen. And look at those. Oh my gosh. So cute! I'm dead. So, that was Claire's. Now we're on to Sephora. So, my mom got stuff at Sephora too, not just me. So, we were both equally bad. I think you were worth badder than I was. Is batter a word? Yes. Yes. This was me. Oh, I don't have your receipt, so I can't tell. Okay, anyways, I'm gonna show them what we both got. My mom got Sol de Janeiro Brazilian Crush Fragrance. Fragrance. Um, and then she got a lip injection in the shade, what's the shade, Soulmate. She loves these lip injection things so much. And then she got two of those Kaja bento boxes. She got like this brownish, nudish colored one. And she got a pink one. Her half favorite off. color is pink. Oh yeah, they were half off. So I wasn't planning on getting one, but then I got one because they were half off. And this is why you should not take me shopping. Oh, my allergies are getting so bad. Do you hear my voice? So I got... Oh. <laughs> what? Oh, I'm sure you're... Viewers are gonna <laughs> love that. <laughs> I got the peachy one. Here, I'll open it. Show you guys. Why are they called bento boxes? Because they're like a bento box. Do you know what a bento box yes, is? Yes, I know what a bento yeah, box is. Yeah, it's like little, little compartments all together in one. Got that. Oh, it has a mirror. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. And then we have. I got a fragrance, also from Sol de Janeiro, in a Brazilian Crush. Oh, that's not the name of it. <laughs> okay, my mom's was coconut cream and toast praline. Mine is K 
caramelized vanilla and macadamia. And then I got Sol de Janeiro Brazilian Kiss Lip Butter. If you guys watch Paige Corn, she loves like anything Sol de Janeiro. So I'm getting this off of her recommendation. We were just in Target and I saw the shirt that she just showed on her channel. My mom likes bought. Page Corn too. I do like Page Corn. So, we're, I'm blaming all of my Sol de Janeiro products on Page Corn. There you go. And then, I got a palette. So, they put these like beeper anti-theft things on like big expensive things like this palette. And like, if I set it down, it would beep. And I was like, shut up, I'm just putting you down. Yeah, that was weird. It made me very anxious. I mean, I could understand why it beeped when we got near the edge of the store, but what was the beeping about you putting it down? I don't know. So I got the Too Faced, <laughs> Born This Way, The Natural Nudes. I have been just like, wanting this palette since it came out. So I thought it was justified that I got it because, okay, this is what Lauren May Beauty says. She's always like, when something comes out, she's like, I like to wait and see if I still want it after like a month or two. It's been many months, I still want this, so I was like, I'm gonna buy it. Clearly I haven't forgotten about it, and clearly I still want it, so I'm gonna buy it. So, comes with a little booklet, how cute. Different looks. This is what it looks like. Like this is like fall in a palette to me. And I'm hyped. Like I like how there's like a row and for each row it's like the same color but there's a matte and there's a shimmer. And I just like that. Is that pretty? Oh that is nice. Oh I've seen that palette on TV before. <laughs> Your big turn. Hold on. I'm holding it. Oh! Okay. Also, it's getting very dark. We might die in a tornado before we go home. But it'll make it'll be good. <laughs> it'll content. be great content. <laughs> so, um, my kidney stone has gotten significantly worse since we left this morning. My kidney stone does not like activity, walking, driving, anything really. So, of course, like my kidney stone has been pretty chill for like the past three days. But then of course we go out and it's like angry as heck. So my kidney stone is bothering me like a lot. And my allergies. So I'm like, hashtag <laughs> suffering. But I got a seltzer. I love seltzer so much. I used to not like seltzer. I trained myself to like seltzer. So that's why I feel like I can train myself to like tea. I'm still in the process of that. I really, like, I genuinely enjoy peach tea, but any other tea, it's like a stretch to say that I, like, I enjoy it. It's more like I'm tolerating it. But I'm, like, working on that. Because I made myself like seltzer. So I feel like I can make myself like tea. Because I feel like they're kind of similar. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed whatever this video is. It's like a haul and a vlog. All in one. I probably spent like $400 today. It was bad. And this is why we only go out once a year. You know, I'm trying to th Okay, so we did actually go to the Crossgates Mall this year. But that was because I broke my MacBook screen. But... Oh yeah, my mom broke her computer screen. Seriously, the last time we went to the mall was last year. Was last year. Except I went with Becca, but that didn't really count. You went to the mall with Becca? Oh, in Syracuse. Oh yeah, that's kind of different. You did spend money there though. I went to Five Below. Yeah. Those gummy bears you were eating last night? <gasps> we were supposed to buy gummy yes, bears. Yes, we were. Those are from Five Below. I can tell you how much the bag costs. Five dollars. <laughs> <laughs> oh my phone's gonna fall so anyways i hope you guys enjoyed 
this video, my extravaganza of a day. I'm very tired, I'm very painful. My feet hurt really bad because I have flat feet. And I have tried art support inserts. They don't work for me, so suggest something else. Thanks. <laughs> Leave me a thumbs up. Suman is always telling me like, have you tried art inserts? Yes, I've tried art inserts. They don't work. My feet suck. Leave me a thumbs up if you enjoyed. <laughs> Comment down below any of your thoughts on this video. Are you ready for spooky season? Because I am so ready. Angel's going to be ready too because she has her pineapple costume and her taco costume from last year. So she's all set. Oh my gosh, those clouds look I know. so scary. Hit the subscribe button, turn on post notifications, and I'll see you guys. <laughs> that didn't work. <laughs> In my next video. <laughs>